of John's chicken meals for the day. So he just had meal one, meal two, this is gonna be meal three and meal four. Um, I cut, I obviously cleaned my chicken first and then I cut it. Um, John likes it very thin cuts, um, almost like chicken nuggies. <laughs> but anyway, I cut it very thin. I measure it out. He's having 300 grams of chicken per meal. So this is going to be his next meal. This is gonna be the following. This is, I'm done with this chicken for now. Um, we get all of our proteins from wild pork, uh, which we love. It's local and um, it's amazing. Their proteins are all grass fed and you know, everything's organic. It's, it's a great place. So he's had a very good digestion this prep, as I would say. Now I'm going to season his chicken. Um, right now, also, since we're so close to the show, we uh, measure all of his salt intake for the day. So he's having 12 grams of salt per day. So now we measure it prior and then I season accordingly. I kind of have an eye now for per meal, how much to use. And then by meal six, he's had all of his salt for the day. Floridian down to the source is perfect oh. natural, just like our spring water, except for hills. This is how we flow. Then there's the after the after. Like us. Favorite. And that's why more men choose just for men. Seasoning. You know, Priceline helps families save up to 60% on family wants fun to come home. out. So many great trips. Yeah. We might just live here with another vacation baby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He loves this chicken, by the way. It's like my, his favorite way I make chicken. So it kind of, oh, here it is. Sweet basil. Lime juice with zero calories. <laughs> so I usually put two grams of olive oil on his sweet potato and then maybe three grams on his chicken. guys with Ivan um, getting my next meal in but I'm also gonna make sure I hydrate after the massage you should always hydrate but especially after massage some things you know obviously Yamamoto Logitech there's about seven grams per serving in here I'm doing two just because I like to be extra hydrated you know my skin <laughs> no. um, Baby, can I have a thing to stir this? Um, but yeah, especially after you're done getting a massage, I want to make sure that I'm um, really hydrated. The muscles get hydrated. And, um, you're just ready to go to work, you know? 
you're gonna be ready to train, the muscles are hydrated, they're more pliable. So, I'm sure my wife was describing to you guys like what's going on with the salt and we are currently measuring everything that I'm putting in my body, including sodium. So, I start out the day, I measure out 12 grams, which is all here, it's pink Himalayan sea salt. Um, and then I, we utilize it to season the food, I sometimes put it in my drink. Um, but we're making sure that we get 12 grams per day, so that way we know exactly how to manipulate water, sodium, all of those things going into the show. So um, this is probably going to get reduced to, I don't know, six grams by the time we hit the show day. Um, water is also being calculated. So it's really precise the way we do things. We, we know exactly what's going in food-wise, carbs, protein, fats, water, sodium, everything is being calculated. Um, just so that way, peak week, we understand exactly what's going on and what we need to manipulate or move around to make sure that we get we present the best package on stage all right guys so we are just finishing up now our massage therapy um we're nine days out from the tampa pro um so today is usually my rest and recovery day thursdays and sundays not really too sure what's going to happen this sunday I'm waiting for coach's orders on that we're kind of going day by day with how my physique is reacting. But normally on Thursdays, like I said, I do my massage therapy, tanning, whatever needs to get done around the house, and uh, shopping. So we're headed over to a local, um, I don't want to say it's a supermarket, but a food store where I get my proteins. The place is called Wild Fork. If you guys have one by you, uh, I would definitely recommend checking it out good quality meats the only difference here is that the meats are frozen everything you get is frozen um, which keeps it fresher longer so uh, yeah we're gonna get some proteins for the week some steak some ground beef some shrimp chicken and uh, we'll show you what that looks like So this is the chicken I get, guys. See his boneless, skinless chicken breasts. Never, have never given any antibiotics or hormones. I like to get this one. Um, I get, I get, I go through about a bag per day. So I get six to seven of these for the week. And then next Thursday, I come back and do it again. So we'll get seven of these. Tay's on her corn carnivore diet, so I just get her a bunch of beef. I don't know if she'd like that. You mean chili, bro? <laughs> it's just, it's just ground beef. I'm a week out. She's making chili. <laughs> it's just ground beef. Anyways, <laughs> as I suffer here smelling chili and watching my wife eat a delicious steak, when I get to eat shrimp and chicken, 
make sure you guys uh, like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We appreciate you guys' love and support. Um, stay tuned, man. We're going to have more and more uh, episodes coming out. Please let us know in the comments what else you'd like to see. My man Brandon behind the uh, camera is doing a phenomenal job. So shout out to him. Um, let us know again what you guys like to see more of. If it's more day in the life stuff, more recovery stuff, some training stuff, obviously, um, meal prep stuff, whatever it is that you guys want to see, let us know. Hit that like button, subscribe, and we'll see you guys again next week.